Hey everybody, Butch Hartman here, the creator of The Garden Cartoon, and we are so excited to have you joining us as part of The Garden Family. And I am so thrilled because our theme is the love of Jesus. Who doesn't love that? The Garden Cartoon is a great way for your kids and your grandkids and you to experience that love. We learn all about Jesus, all about the Bible in The Garden Cartoon, and plus we get to have a lot of laughs too. And please enjoy this exclusive clip from one of our very most amazing episodes called Truth is the main thing. In this episode, it's Lucy the Lamb's birthday, and she's all excited. She wants Lenny to wish her happy birthday, and I can't wait to see what kind of a day Lenny has for me. But Lenny's kind of acting suspicious and doing things that, well, don't really seem to add up, and Lucy starts to realize that, you know, maybe I can't really trust Lenny. Maybe he's not my friend. Maybe he's not being honest with me. And we really learned through this episode what honesty and trust is all about. Think about it. Honesty and trust are so important, because if we don't have honesty and trust with each other, we really don't have anything. When my girls, Carly and Sophia, who are now full grown, when they were really little, I tried to instill in them honesty and trust in so many ways because they had to learn how to rely on each other. And if you can't trust someone, you really can't rely on them. It's really, really a very important thing to trust somebody because when you trust somebody, when people can trust you, that is so important. That means people will want to be around you, they'll want to work with you, they'll want to be your friend, and they'll really want to spend life with you. If you can trust somebody, boy, that is just the most amazing thing ever. So keep an eye out for some brand new emails coming your way, and our next email is going to include a really fun activity for you and your kids to do together. And for this activity, you're going to need a piece of paper, a glue stick, some glitter, because we all have glitter just lying everywhere, right? And something to write with, like a marker or a crayon, and it'll be so much fun, you'll really love it. So keep an eye out, welcome to the garden family. The garden is where the gospel grows. Hello, Leticia. Are you ready for your beauty treatment? Hello, Lucy. Am I glad to see you, girl. My head is dirt. Hey. Ooh, girl, you would not believe what I heard about those carrots. Talk to me. Well, arugula told me she heard they actually use spray tan. Get out! Girl, I'm serious. Skin that orange is not natural. It's from a bottle. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, girls, you know you're not supposed to gossip. You're right, Lucy. That was wrong. We're sorry. Right, Lenny? Right, Lucy. Ah. Ellie, where did Lenny go this time? I believe my hairdo explains my whereabouts, or hairabouts. Lenny, where have you been? And why are you holding a balloon? What balloon? Are you lying to me? Honestly, Lucy, I may be a lion, but I'm not lying. I feel like Lenny is lying to me. He always leaves when we're doing our tasks and never tells me where he's going. Thanks for coming to me and telling me how you feel, Lucy. Honesty among friends is very important. In fact, one of the Ten Commandments is thou shalt not lie. Now let me ask you this. Do you love Lenny? Of course I do. He's my best friend. Then you need to do your best to trust him. This reminds me of the time when the Apostle Paul wrote a letter to the Corinthians. In 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 7, he said, Love always hopes for the best and always perseveres. That means even if you suspect Lenny isn't being honest with you, since you love him, you need to expect the best and hold on to that trust as long as you can. If Lenny is your friend, and if he loves you, he'll be honest with you. Okay, boss. I'm going to do my best to trust Lenny no matter what. Wonderful. Come on, Lucy. We have one more task to take care of. What task? We did everything the boss asked us to do. It's a secret task that he only told me about, and you're gonna love it. <laughs> 